and four essay checks, November 4, Shara Hotel Luxury, listening. Okay, uh, good afternoon. My name is Nash. I'm at your call sign N4 SHX. And uh, what we are going to be doing today is I will show you how to use the Comet uh, Cat 300. And uh, this is actually a manual tuner and uh, it can actually handle uh, an impedance of uh, between 50 to 600 ohms. Okay, so right now, um, nakatune tayo sa dekada. Okay, and uh, ngayon nakatune tayo sa dekada and uh, this is, uh, this uh, antenna tuner has a built-in uh, SWR meter then it's actually divided into uh, three knobs then you have some buttons here so the first button that we have here is actually yung power range natin meron kang uh, 30 watts at saka 300 watts so this antenna tuner can handle up to 300 watts of uh, power then you also have your uh, average or your PEP uh, measurement then you have your uh, TR tune. TR tune is actually uh, tuning on the side of uh, the radio. Then your X tune mo is tuning on the side of the antenna. And of course, you have your frequency band. Then you have your on and off. So pag naka off siya, it's basically bypass. And then you have uh, the antenna switch. So right now, um, I only have one antenna connected to this unit. Um, Nakakonek ako doon sa... Um, I have uh, here um, an antenna switch. So, medyo matigas kasi yung isang uh, cable ng kowak. So, I just use uh, antenna 1. Okay, so if you can see, if I uh, remove antenna 2, mawawala yung signal here. But if I click on antenna 1, mabalik siya. So, to show you that uh, this, we're on the kada. And uh, to check the SWR, we can also check the SWR here and the SWR down here. So the first thing to do would be uh, to tune this would be to change the mode to AM. Bakit siya AM? Kasi kailangan natin ng steady carrier. Now, what we will do is we're gonna be moving uh, 5 MHz down. Para hindi tayo makakastorbo sa iba habang nag-tune tayo. So let's check the SWR. So, also make sure that uh, you're on low power kasi malaki yung tendency na masira yung radio nyo if nag-tune kayo on high power. So, make sure that you only have about 5 watts and also, the power range is 30 watts. Okay, tama naman. And that's test. And as you can see, um, the SWR for this one is over 5 going to infinity and even here, kinakonfirm nung uh, antenna tuner natin na mataas yung SWR niya. Now, the next thing to do is um, tignan natin kung kaya siyang itune within this band. So, it doesn't really matter what band you use. Um, basically, uh, depende, depende sa inyo kung saan nyo mapapababa yung SWR nyo. Let's try to see if kaya natin siyang itune using the 40 meter band. Okay? Let's uh, hit the PTT. So, we have the steady carrier and then let's try to switch kung bababa yung SWR. Okay. And from what it seems, napababa natin yung SWR. So as you can see, bumaba yung SWR dito and also bumaba yung SWR dito. Now, the next step would be to fine-tune. So that's the initial tuning. The fine-tuning goes to, itaas natin to to about 30 watts. And kung makikita nyo dito, tataas pa yung SWR niya. So kanina, balik natin ulit sa 5 watts. Sa 5 watts, mukhang okay na siya, di ba? Mukhang okay na siya. Pero pag tinaas mo yung power niya, tataas yung SWR niya. So magpa-fine tuning tayo. Let's go to about uh, 30 watts. And see if kaya natin pababain yung SWR. And as you can see, napapababa pa natin siya. And there you go. So as of now, we have an SWR of almost perfect or 1 is to 1. And then here, makita natin yung SWR needle natin. It's actually not moving. Okay. 
So the next thing to do is to switch the mode into lower sideband, which is our sideband, and then transmit. One, one, two, three, four. Okay, so from what it seems, mataas yung SWR niya dito sa banda na to. What we're gonna do would be to switch to a different band and then go back to the tuning. Let's go to AM and then do the same process. Okay, and then let's increase it again. Okay, so from what it seems, halos hindi na natin to kailangan ni adjust. And there you go. And then again, let's switch to lower sideband. And then let's check pag nag-transmit tayo. One, two, Three, four. One, two, three, four. Audio. Test. One, two, three, four. And there you go. Okay. So next natin gawin, di pa tayo ng uh, frequency. Let's try here. Switch the carrier to AM. Low power. Let's see the SWR. And as you can see, mataas yung SWR natin. Let's try to uh, fine tune. Uh, let's try to tune it. Mm -hmm. Okay, as you can see, hindi siya masyadong bumababa. But there... Okay, let's increase the power to about 30 watts. Let's do some fine tuning. Oops. Okay, let's switch to upper side band, uh, lower side band, and let's check. N4 SHX stroke DU1 testing, 1, 2, 3, 4. And uh, that's basically how you use the CAT300 tuner. So the same thing goes even if you, uh, let's say, uh, switch the band to uh, 20. Let's switch to uh, AM. Check the SWR. Mataas, mataas. So let's try to tune. Okay, so mukhang kaya natin pababain. Let's switch to uh, increase the RF power. And there you go. And then let's switch to lower side band. N4 SHX stroke DU1 testing. 1, 2, 3, 4. And there you go. So as you can see, uh, the antenna tuner actually works without any issues. So if you have any more questions regarding this antenna tuner and where to get this, um, this is actually available uh, with uh, EIB radio. Ketito Warren. So thank you for watching. 73 and uh, mabuhay. N4 SHX November 4 Shara Hotel X-Ray listening.